Hello guys, we have the fattest basket of empties because I did not fill the empty basket last week and I kept all of the empties. Hopefully I can remember enough about them. But last week, I always film these on Sundays and last Sunday was Christmas and I was just not going to film. This wasn't happening. So, we are going to just jump right into the empties. Happy New Year everybody. And yeah, we had French Baguette from Black Magic Melts, which was pretty good. Love me a bread scent. We had Merry Christmas Shitter was full and Peppermint Swirl. This was okay. It wasn't as strong of a peppermint as I personally like because I like peppermint that like suffocates you. Um, Andrea gave me a couple of chunks of this Teddy Bee's Christmas cookies, which was an assortment of baked cookies, powdered sugar, buttercream pine and warm spices this was actually really good she melted this and had really good performance from it and i'm not really convinced on teddy bees because everything i've melted i've had terrible performance with but this one was really good so i did enjoy that in the bathroom i did rosemary mint boom boom pistachio ice cream this was pretty good it was so strong i walked into my bedroom and it overpowered my two bedroom warmers just like my small bathroom plug-in overpowered everything so, if you like those types of scents, highly recommend. Pretzel Bakery Bomb from L3. This I melted last night. I put it in a couple of hours before we left to go to Andrea's. And when I came home, I opened the door. It smacked me in the face. It was so strong of like a yeasty, bready scent with a hint of sweetness. Highly recommend. We had Pretzel Rack from Sassy Girl Aroma. This one was kind of a flop for me. It was like fine, but it just wasn't as strong as I wanted. It was cinnamon pretzel vanilla icing. I went very nose blind to it. Honestly, I'd probably buy it again because I'll forget that I didn't love it, but it wasn't my fave. We had Snow Globe from Salt Mountain Melts, and this was Spearmint, Icy, Peppermint, and Buttermint. So this was really, really good. A very nice, minty, relaxing scent. Would get again. From VCS, we have Ross, Rachel, Ross and Rachel and Jill, Strawberry Pound Cake, Yellow Cake, Zucchini Bread, and Raspberry Jam. This was fine. I melted it mostly in the living room because I didn't really like that raspberry note. We had Breakfast of Champions from Sassy Girl Aroma, which is jelly donuts, crunch berries, and sugar cookies. This was very good, very, very, very strong, lasted a super long time. It was just an extra fruity version of crunch berries, so if you like crunch berry, highly recommend. Green Machine, you guys know. This one's amazing. It's pistachio, sugar cookie, and zucchini marshmallow from Sassy Girl Aroma. It's just so good. It's one of the best pistachio scents of all time. I will always repurchase. We said it's we had it's okay to make mistakes. Cafe Vienna, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Zucchini Bread, and a slight hint of pretzel. This was a nice cinnamon coffee scent. It was really, really good. Would repurchase. We had mama. And this was Midsummer's Night type. I love that for the bathroom. Very strong. Zucchini bread, vanilla cinnamon from Black Magic Mouth. This one I didn't really smell. So that was not something I would repurchase. We've got lots of scent shots. This isn't even all of them. This is just all of them on this layer. We had two Whoville. I melted this on Christmas morning. And it's ginger, nutmeg, vanilla, cocoa. A nice Christmas spicy scent. Oh, and another Whoville. Rosalina, which is Mexican fried ice cream. This scent I usually don't, like this scent note usually doesn't do much for me. But I melted it in my bedroom and it really did smell like a nice cinnamon ice cream scent. So that was really good. Hazelnut coffee, but from Niv Fantasy Wax. And I do have a code with Fantasy Wax. You can use Hannah 10 for 10% off. Hazelnut coffee, this was fantastic. I loved it. Louie, which was cornbread. Uh, it's so good. It's so yeasty and bready and just delicious. Obsessed. We had Hogsmeade, which is French baguette from Fantasy Wax. I swear to God, this last would have lasted if I let it like 48 hours. It was so strong, so bready, so just oh, loved it. So good. We had a crisp from Black Magic Mouse, which is a great peppermint scent. It was from my collab. We had this cake custom of Andrea's, which was gingerbread, sugar cookie, crunch, and sticker doodle. This was amazing. I would definitely remake that. From Sassy Girl Aroma, we had berry, fur, balsam, musk, and vanilla. This was a nice Christmas tree scent. I melted that in the bathroom. We had Auntie Hands from Black Magic Melts, which is a very good pretzel. It's pretzel bread and zucchini bread. Love it. Super good. This was Christmas cookies. This gave me um kind of like a spice cookie. 
energy. It was fine, not my favorite. Orange chiffon cake and iced cinnamon rolls. This scent reminds me of my dad because orange iced cinnamon rolls just gives me him energy and it was pretty good. We had red zucchini from Sassy Girl Aroma, which was cherry, marshmallow, zucchini bread, and vanilla waffle cone. This was okay. The cherry was almost like too leaning on maraschino sweet cherry rather than like a juicy cherry. I wouldn't get it again, but it was fine. Oh, we have one unempty. I forgot this was in here. It is this Gryffindor Harry Potter scent. I melted it one day in both the bathrooms and it smelled like Megan strips. So, that no from me. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I'm not keeping it. This is Let It Go from L3, which is Spearmint, Noel, and Cotton Candy. This is pretty good. Would get it again. Chocolate chip pancakes. This, I don't really remember, but I wouldn't get it again because Chris hates chocolate. But I remember it smelling quite maple-y, which I enjoy. Again, this one's been in an upright chocolate chip cookie dough and waffle cone. I really enjoyed it, but Chris hates chocolate, so I'm not going to subject him to that. Oh my god, this one. Starbeans Cafe. Espresso, vanilla crunch donuts, and vanilla bean oil. This is my favorite coffee scent of all time, period, hands down. Almond Joy. I had to turn this one off. I did not like it. It was very sunscreen. If I have any more of those, those will be sent to my sister. Um, this was a custom I did with sassy wax melts and chewy pretzel, coffee beans, zucchini bread. It just smelled like pretzel. Would knock it again. We had Sis from Black Magic Melts, which is coffee bean, orange chiffon cake, and sugar cookie. It was fabulous. Obviously, the ones with my collab scents I am partial to because I picked them. Three, four more bags, and then a bunch more shop cups. We had Pikachu, which was iced lemon cookies. This one was kind of light. I melted this sample in the bathroom in silver and gold Christmas vacation. No idea what this is supposed to smell like. It smelled like apple and I absolutely hated it. Um, vanilla milk Danish butter cookie and Christmas splendid or splendor. I don't know. I don't think I like that Christmas splendor. Whatever. It was not my favorite. That one I would not remake. This one was phenomenal. Gingerbread, zucchini bread, and sugar cookie royale. Love her. Love her. We had Ellie and Carl, which is strawberry white cake. Can't go wrong with that scent note. Even Chris loved that one. We had the Santa Claus, which was gingerbread. Another scent note that I'm obsessed with. So it was great. Um, a Christmas Carol was eggnog. Eggnog's not my favorite, so I did not love that one. We have Max, which was orange. Um, cinnamon, orange zest, and cranberry, and woods. Melted this in the bathroom. It was very nice and Christmassy. We had Claws, which was vanilla butter sugar cookies. It was more of a basic cookie scent, but I enjoy those. Shrieking Chef, which is pie crust. If you know me, you know I'm obsessed with just plain pie crust, so I loved. Pam and Jim, chocolate covered strawberries. This was good for a chocolate covered strawberry scent, but again, we're not really a chocolate household, so I would not get that again. And then finally, we had Polar Express, which was mountain, balsam, cedarwood, and cranberry. Super good, woodsy Christmas scent that I melted in the bathroom. Of empties. We did it, guys. It took eight minutes. And, oops, tossing everything back into the basket so I can toss it away. There are some things that are rollovers, so but technically, you guys wouldn't really know that because I didn't fill a basket last week. So, I am currently working on Eloise at Christmas time from Fantasy Wax, which is sweater weather type in the bathroom. I don't really like sweater weather, but I like Eloise at Christmas time, which is why I own that. Um, I've been working on this um, custom from L3, which is strawberry zucchini bread. Strawberry bread zucchini bread. I love the strawberry bread oil, so it's yum. And I'm still working on my Hannah's Baby gigantic monstrous thingamabob. We have another Auntie Hands. This portion of like my wax that I'm digging through has like all of my like collab wax from when I did that collab, so we have a lot of it this i pulled last week and didn't get to and this is the pharmacist daughter king cake which is coffee house morning beignet french custard sugar cookie donuts and cinnamon sugar donuts i feel like this one's very popular from them and it's so good on cold i'm excited and i have two pieces left of sea salt caramel pretzel zucchini bread pink frosted animal cookies to finish up so good we have donald duck which is just kettle corn I remember when Kirsten found this oil, she texted me and she's like, I finally found a kettle cord I don't hate. So I'm so excited to melt that and give her a go. We have cookies with the clauses, zucchini bread. 
Smells really good. I'm very excited. I love their cookies with the claws as well. So hyped. We have Night Bus, which is orange Danish and fresh coffee. Mm. Oh my god, this is so good. Mmm. Very excited. Buddy the Elf, which is musical or magical blend of candies and soda pop bubbles. This will definitely be going to Chris's office. It's a very fizzy pop scent, which isn't my favorite, but he really enjoys those scents, so that'll be nice. I pulled two Cindy Lou Who's, which is now their peppermint candy canes, which is like their core scent. Um, I pulled two of these, which I'm not mad about because this is such like a relaxing, it's the best peppermint of all time. If you are a peppermint lover, run to Fantasy Wax and get this mint scent. It's so good. We got Joey Gladstone, which is sugar corn pudding. Say less. I love sugar corn pudding. Snap bar from Black Magic Melt. We have got Moonchild, which is marshmallow, vanilla, dark chocolate, and florals. I don't think it really smells like any of those things. It's just like a nice perfume. So that'll be good for the bathroom. We also have another Mama for the bathroom, which is Midsummer's Night type. We have one of the Planet Hannah bars, which is zucchini bread, strawberry, and birthday cake. Love it. I love strawberry bakery. And we have a cinnamon sugar pretzel, which is <laughs> exactly what it says. Um, okay, we have some things from L3 here. Banana cream pie and pound cake. This one's not very strong. I swear, these buns, you cut into them and then the scent comes out for some reason. We've got another one of my customs. I have been keeping them in a poly, the bakery bag inside a poly bag. And then when I go to use them, I just take them out of the poly bag. But this one's roasted coffee, pink, roasted coffee pretzel and pink frosted animal cookies. Oh my God, stop. Look at the little pig. It's so cute. This is so good. You really get the pink frosted animal cookie and then you get that coffee and the pretzel. I'm excited about that. I love that you don't have to cut those. And then we have Sugar Cookie Royale from L3. Andrea just recently gave this to me because I said I haven't melted plain Sugar Cookie Royale from them. And she's like, you have to. So, and she's like, and you have to put it in your basket, like, now. So I did. We have a couple things from Sassy Girl Aroma. We have Pretzel Milkshake, which is one of these like little cups. And it's pre creamy vanilla ice cream, salty pretzel bits, and gooey chocolate drizzle. This just smells like a straight up pretzel. That's very strong. We also have this snap bar, which has seen better days. This is 100% me and my terrible storage. And I think I gave part of this to Kirsten. And this one's blackberry, zucchini bread, and birthday cake. It's giving me very blackberry jam butter cookie vibes, which I enjoy. So that'll be good. We've got another one of Andrea's K Customs. This will be going in the bathroom. And it's pink sugar, blue sugar, marshmallow. Very good. I love pink sugar and blue sugar mixed together. The marshmallow adds a bit of sweetness. And then finally from Birdies, we have Mind Your Biscuits, which is buttercream maple frosting, creme brulee, and French baguette. Very nice, like hint of maple. You get the bread scent. I'm excited. So that's everything, guys. I'm going to go choppy chop chop all of the thingamabobs that don't come in something that I don't have to cut up and then I'm gonna get to work and have a real nice day but thank you guys so much for watching if you liked this video give it a thumbs up if you did not then we'll give it a thumbs down because either way you're helping out my channel comment down below subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next one bye guys